Hi. Ja, glem. I forgot to turn on uh, these lights here, oh. so we might look a bit dark. But uh, you want me to uh, click maybe, some, no, some buttons? No, maybe that's fine. See what happens. Maybe we look more yeah. natural for a change. Mm. Also, see the green screen is a bit off there. I first of all, I'd love to apologize for the atrocious chat window that looks like <laughs> that now, not Rune, <laughs> but that window. <laughs> My intention. Oh, and I. Yeah. Ah, yeah. there's a slight overlap. I wish I could start oh, like highlight. My yes. my intentions were good. I wanted the YouTube uh, commenters to be featured in uh, in the stream as well because before it was only Twitch, and I wanted YouTube to be a part of it. And I decided to fix that uh, like five minutes before we went live. And now the chat window looks like that, and I didn't know how to fix it last second. So you gotta live with that. I promise I'll make it look better for the next stream uh, while still having uh, everyone uh, included. Yeah. Um, I can see I'm wearing the right shirt today. I didn't know I was going to be on the stream, but it kind of suits the... And it's not semi-transparent, even though I think that's pretty cool. <laughs> no, you were wearing something green last time, right? Yeah, <laughs> got a little teal. weird. Yeah. You have a, before we get started, you have a quick note about two of the last blocks in that video. Oh yeah, uh, you are not the only one that was in a rush today. We want to bring you the, the very... Um, uh, up-to-date version of uh, how the upcoming content is so uh, so things got a little bit rushed and two of the names got swapped so the fire truck siren and the emergency light I think it was that was swapped but uh, I'm sure the viewers can figure that out if they watch the version that ah, if they watch the version that will be on YouTube later soon then no, that should be fixed I think nah maybe later but I yes, I think we're re-rendering with that <laughs> fix in. So okay, uh, yeah. So now you know that, and uh, well, there's a lot to unpack there. A lot to happen. Like there was a few free blocks in the beginning, and then everything you saw marked uh, risk of DLC uh, will be the paid uh, DLC. Yeah. So, but there's a little for both, like we always do the. Yeah, as usual, we we want to uh, to bring something for free, uh, but we also need to uh, <laughs> bring some uh, some uh, money in the coffins uh, so we can keep uh, developing the game. So uh, so we have to strike a balance. Struggle so. says quay 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 quay. We gotta subscribe. <laughs> that has only happened a few times. Well, I've uh, well I've been in charge of this. Let's go over to Trail Makers here. Yeah. Uh, excellent. Thank you for the subscribe. <laughs> Thank you for the subscribe. I have... Subscribe usually means money. I have no earthly idea where that money goes. Uh, yeah, that's a good question. <laughs> Hopefully for more development. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully, yeah. Uh, I'm hearing that now in-game sound should not be that loud now. Follow sound is also loud. Yeah, it was very loud in the last one. I wonder what... Ugh, this is always... Uh, I don't know which one that's tied to. Could I just hide it, maybe? Does it still play a sound? Or can you guys maybe just not follow? Because <laughs> <laughs> I, so <laughs> I think I had an issue with this last time as well. I think I turned it down now. Mm. Um, okay, they would like to see it in data. I think uh, for some of the things we're gonna show off today, we might want to switch back, but let's just start there. Let's start. Was that loud? Uh, as that follow sound as loud as it was before? I felt like it was a little lower. We, uh, we got UC in chat, by the way. Yeah, yeah, I know. I saw him in the countdown as well. All right. So, uh, hi, UC. Remember to like, uh, like and subscribe to Yuzi. <laughs> That's a tradition now that I say that every time. Get a time. free block. <laughs> <laughs> Get a free block. Yeah. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised you would say that, <laughs> considering how hey. paranoid you are about the promises I make yeah. sometimes. Well, well, you deal with the consequences. I make the promises, you reel them back in. All right, yeah. fair enough. Uh, is it YouTube only or Twitch? It's both, and we actually got both the chat yeah, again, I know the chat is a bit different. That's because I messed it up last second because I wanted to include the YouTubers. And my so my intentions were good and I'll have it fixed uh, for next time. Um, let's take a look at some blueprints, no? Yeah. 
that uh, I think this one was made by Marco. Yeah, or you can s- see that up there in the corner. Of the yeah, screen. I like how you point. Like <laughs> they yeah, can see where you <laughs> point. <laughs> they can see that I'm intending on pointing. Maybe no, not really. Okay, so take us through it. What are we using here? There is this. So we have two new blocks at the bottom here. We have the keel block and we have the bow block. And they, uh, we're always trying to when we design blocks to to try to make something that is uh, very distinct. Something that is uh, uh, the waves are too high. Yeah, that's that's very like high fidelity, but at the same time we also want modularity. So we, like that's the core of the game that is built. In stuff. If we just make a boat block, then that's not really in the spirit of the game, and it won't really make people that excited. So in this case, we chose to split it up into two. So there's the front part and potentially the the back part if you want to have it uh, symmetric along that axis. And I don't know if there's we, anything we have a else few, uh, yeah. We have a few uh, that use the, the dinghy parts. Yeah. This one yeah. was made by Lucrum. Yeah, and in this case uh, we also chose to uh, make two separate parts. One for the corner, the rounded part, and uh, one for the uh, side. That allowed you to, uh, to choose the, side of, uh, the size of your dinghy. Uh, along uh, <laughs> the two uh, axes, right? The, the width and the length. It's such a silly name though, Dingy. Yeah, I love that name. <laughs> 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 um, yeah, but uh, we were also like, exploring whether we should uh, do some end parts for that, but uh, I can see that there was a Lucrum uh, found a very uh, good solution for that with the... Uh, Rounded corners. Yes. Yeah, so it actually just looks like it's part yeah. of the block. Yeah, it looks so good. Very yeah, good, it does. Uh, blueprint there. That'll be very useful in shaping, yeah. Yeah. So it's not only for for uh, building boats like this, I guess. This was just, I guess, the idea of it. But uh, knowing our community, it will probably be used for yeah rope. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe even probably. <laughs> um, but again, here we also d- made some decisions about how much details we wanted to have because we wanted to be able to extend into the existing system, the existing blocks. But we also want to give it a feel of being this inflatable rubber part. So I, I think we found a good balance. Hopefully the players will uh, will see that uh, and uh, and agree. Yeah. Though it's hard to do everything at once. Mm-hmm. I yeah. also kind of wanted to show this one built by Sarath because this one is I think is really cool. And this one also incorporates the firework block. Ooh. And for that I do want to turn mm. the time of day down a little I don't know how loud the <laughs> game will be now probably very loud I'll try to find uh, I have a feeling it's gonna be very loud anyways the controls here are absolutely insane <laughs> <laughs> I've tried rolling your face on the keyboard. <laughs> I think that might be the way to get I'm to do things I'm actually only interested in the fireworks um, which is of course not included <laughs> in the <laughs> controls. Mm-hmm. Sarath, where are you? Are you in the chat? Try them all. It's probably one, two, or three. No. Oi. Oh, there we have the fire truck siren, and uh, I can see he's paired it up with the <laughs> turning the lanterns from the high seas uh, expansion on and off. There. This is a proper rescue boat. Yeah. And a very distinct uh, like look to it. I immediately when I saw it, I was like, "Yep, I know who made that." <laughs> yep, that's quite cool when players get that uh, style of their own. I know the fireworks are here somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> um. In the meantime, I <laughs> mentioned that it also has the emergency lights and the. I promised oh, to left say click. okay before you yeah. uh, I promised to uh, mention that the emergency light in this version is uh, the most rough uh, of the blocks, so that's gonna change uh, significantly for the release, I think. Um, but of course, everything is subject to change, so uh, yeah, things might uh, be what, slightly what, different. What the crane doing? <laughs> <laughs> that's a good question. Okay, here we go. Ready for this? Yeah. 
Oh, that was a signal flare. <laughs> <It's> a signal <laughs> flare. I forgot yeah. about that. Yeah. But I guess we're showing the signal flare then. Yeah. <laughs> I also thing. have disclaimers for that. I feel like I have disclaimers for <laughs> everything today. Um, but uh, I'm so glad that you said signal flare and not just flare because I want to make this uh, perfectly clear that this is meant as an aesthetic block. Um, so it's not a countermeasures flare or something like that. Um, yeah. But uh, hopefully you can still do some cool stuff with it. I, I think it's uh, looking very interesting. And I should mention that uh, you can adjust the colors of these. So if you Ooh. want blue flares, you can totally do that. That's nice. Yeah. I see Sarith went with the classic red flare. Yeah, Look. that makes sense. Does it deal damage as, as by Mechanexus? No. No. Uh, ideally, it should have no other effect than the visual and the sound effect it makes. Uh, so it should just be to uh, be cool. We are, we are very careful not to uh, not to make uh, pay-to-win blocks. Basically, we want everybody to feel like they can participate in playing in multiplayer servers. Um, so we we try to to strike a good balance there. And yeah, so no damage. Um, I think they explode if you hit the water surface or if you hit walls or the ground or something. So. Uh, but uh, of course, uh, yeah. Okay. Fireworks. Let's look at fireworks, because yeah. that's my favorite part. And I build a little doohickey for it. This thing it just yeah. needs to be flipped around. Oh, real quick. Why did you build it on the side? <laughs> I did. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah. I want to. Get out here. I don't know. Th I think time is frozen. So let me just fix that. <laughs> oh. Time is no longer frozen. All right. And we need uh, to. Uh, cooldown is probably on right after you spawn it. So. Look yeah. at that. Nice. Okay, it better also. Better miss the show. Better miss the show. Yeah, but the, the cinematic camera was being a little weird. But let's do it from a first-person point of view here instead. Ooh. Perfect with the following. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We're celebrating. Yeah, I've always felt like uh, when we had a, a New Year's build challenge or, or a builder of the year or something, we needed uh, some fireworks, some celebration, and uh, finally now uh, we have that. Finally now we do have that. Let me just... Can I turn up the sp speed? Space, hold, and then it should adjust the speed. Oh, there we go. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Mm. And uh, as with the, the flare, you can change the color here as well. And I believe it actually has support for both colors. You want to try that out live? Yeah, let's do it. I'm just looking at some more flares here or some more uh, fireworks here. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. Wait, what is the key bind for the cinematic camera? It's the same as the old camera. For uh, mouse and keyboard. Oh yes, for controller it's... Uh, what is it? It's the... Is it the two bumpers? Yeah, two bumpers at the same time, yeah. I think. Okay, let's... Let's, uh, oh. let's change the secondary color as the one that changes it, right? Uh, I think it's both, so try both. Oh, so they can have like a mix? Yeah, so do green and uh, something crazy. Now oh, they're both green. I'm way too colorblind to be able to make uh, <laughs> some good matches here. Uh, let's just try some things. Okay. Uh, I think... Trial and error is always a uh, good approach, I think. Oh, look at that. Yeah. That is noise. Okay, I cannot use the cinematic camera for this. I think we will just be using uh, this thing. That looks nice. Yeah. I, I haven't got a chance to do this yet, but I kind of want to put them on some hinges and uh, like 
rotate the hinges ever so slightly. I should uh, get a different camera view <laughs> to get that effect where it does thing and and do some stuff with timing as well to uh, to make like a proper fireworks show. I guess you have the controls there, so you can just uh, yeah like program it live. But we do have some good looking fireworks here. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah, I, I like that one. Wow. Does it do damage? That seems to be. <laughs> <laughs> that seems no, to be the same answer goes for this as with the signal flare. It's uh, it's not supposed to be a, a combat based block. It's it's supposed to be purely for the aesthetics. What if we do this? So you will not see uh, overpowered uh, fireworks belts. I hope <laughs> until they find some kind of glitch. But they can be used for like, I guess, if you want to do like a cinematic uh, explosion kind of thing. Yeah, sure, sure. You can pretend they do damage. <laughs> <laughs> sure. You can put some dynamite on the thing that you're shooting for the same time. I'll probably be using flares the most. Well, that's totally up to you. Um, I'm very much looking forward to see what the players will be building with your, all these blocks. Yeah. The main difference is that these fireworks are free. The flare is uh, paid DLC. Yeah. The flare is the paid firework. Yeah. But also, like, look at this. This is the free one. Yeah. 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 And it, it was quite important for us to get this one to be a free block because we thought that it would be so such a general block and something that new players would also find a huge uh, benefit from having so we didn't want to to block that uh, from the rest of the players and yeah and to get it into the build challenge to allow people to appreciate it so we made that decision there yeah yeah are any new weapons being added to the game the theme is rescue <laughs> <laughs> who are you gonna rescue with a weapon well uh, <laughs> i think it's safe to say that Unless I'm misunderstanding something that no, there will not be a new weapon. Yeah. In that case, I have uh, completely missed that part. But the theme is, uh, for once, the theme is, yes, I see people going crazy also about the flares. I feel like the next couple of weeks, I'm really going to be telling a lot of people that uh, no, it's not like heat-seeking heat flares that a plane drops when it's trying to avoid a missile. It's a signal flare yeah. for like rescue purposes yeah there's no no military aspect for this really if you want to uh, do a game of hide and seek you can use it for that to uh, sort of do what is the is it marco polo it's uh, called the oh yeah the game i don't think it exists in denmark but oh there's also this one also made by marco oh. which i think it, and it's also using the lattice blocks nope it's uh, the trust blocks. Trust <laughs> that was the one thing I was supposed to say. <laughs> the trust block. Sorry. Uh, I think I'm partly <laughs> to blame for tripping you up there. But, uh, uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah I, I really like this stage, and uh, then some uh, fire show in the back, and uh, yeah, I could definitely uh, see this uh, oh, being really cool as well. Okay. And I'm, I'm sure uh, work if I exit the stage though. <laughs> for the for the players that want to um, to build the uh, construction vehicles, I, I know there's an audience for that. I'm sure they'll be very happy to have these truss blocks as well. Yes. And we should mention there's two different sizes. There's the two by two by two and the two by two by eight. Yes. I can show them in a second. Savra is asking, will there be any new block paints or player skins that are going to be added? Mm, that's a good question. There will be <laughs> new. There will be some dashing new outfits, mm -hmm. but then we will show those next week. Uh, but yes, there will be new outfits. Yeah, like we uh, totally on purpose teased in the last stream. <laughs> yes, <laughs> and there will also be uh, new decals, but that's also for next week. Yeah. Um, yeah, so uh, put a put a note in your calendars. Next week, same time. Next week, same time. Yeah. I also want to show this because this is using the new large stabilizer, right? Uh, no, so no. it's actually not, but it's using the helicopter tail propeller. That's what I meant. And uh, yeah, so uh, we are going a little bit back and forth on this block as well as uh, some of our testers might be aware. Um, so, but we chose to uh, go for a 4x4x2 uh, 
uh, size so that you can use it for all kinds of things. So uh, I remember that Jamie also built like a swamp uh, speeder boat. Yes. Uh, where it's using it as propulsion. So it has multiple purposes as well. I actually also made one. No. I think huh? if I have it here, I made one a while ago with some triple friends in it. <laughs> Yeah, excellent. Yeah, so that's using the, that's using it as a, as like one of those swamp. Uh, yeah. Swamp. Well, I can see you have a bit of propulsion underneath your. Boat ah, as I'm well. cheating a little bit. <laughs> that that one is mostly for <laughs> aesthetics, but okay. the turbo statues are too heavy, man. Oh. I see, I didn't cover that part entirely, mm. but uh, I just wanted to take my friends for a little ride. Yeah. Always nice to go on a boat with some friends. Yeah. And now you can do it in a lot of uh, new ways. So many, so many good news for the boat people. Yeah. Oh, what else do we have here? We have. Um, what about that one? That's that sort of uh, using them for a, a third purpose here. Yeah. Oh, I should also mention that in this one you can see that there's still some placeholder graphics when they spin really fast. You can see that it's based off the small propeller. So <laughs> please disregard <laughs> that. That's going to change. Yeah, but this is a silly little thing, right? Yeah, I think it's very cute, like a chibi style, or I think it's called that. A chibi style? Yeah, where it's like a super choppy, blown out, so many of the details or the outer parts are shrunk down. It might actually be a little tease for the build challenge we're having later, where the theme is tiny. Oh. I think this would, uh, yeah. I think this would go very well with that. Yeah. Look forward to seeing that too. Me too. We <laughs> have a guest host. Uh, that's no, I'm all alone this time around. It's a bit back and forth whether or not uh, people are able to join me. But uh, there is a ton of submissions. So I think we're going to have that. So you don't need distractions anyways. I don't need distractions. Uh, I also kind of want to look at this. But this is another boat. <laughs> but it's because it was made by Terrasol. Yeah. And I just think also just to show the dinghies in another color. Yeah, I think this one looks pretty rad. Yeah, I can mention that we also, when we are designing the dinghy blocks, we are talking about how many bands it should have on the sides. And here we see Terrasol has also com opted for completely removing the bands by uh, coloring them the same color as the, <laughs> as the inflatable parts, so to speak. I like that. Yeah. That's what I'm going to do as well. Yeah. Very cool. Not too rescuey, I'll say, but uh, it's fine. Different, different things. Kimufi, thank you for following. Johannes is alone every time I sub a boat. Girl, I don't know what that means. Um, well, we've got some questions here. I got all the DLC, now I need 1.8 DLC. Well, you'll be able to get it soon enough. I cannot say, I know I actually managed to say on the Discord earlier that we would also be uh, telling you the release date, but that was because of a bit of a, a bit of a mistake we had in one of our plan sheets, uh. which never happens usually. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so so yeah. release date is also next week alongside with all the cosmetic stuff uh, from the DLC. So I once again apologize for spreading misinformation. But it wouldn't be a, a dev diary without me saying something that wasn't correct. It <laughs> uh, adds, adds a bit of mystery. Metal Burgers, I, I don't know if you're being ironic when you say I like the new stream chat layout. <laughs> because I, what I like about it is I can now, the YouTubers are being shown on screen as well. Yeah. But other than that, it's, it's a very intrusive <laughs> new chat window. Yeah. I it's guess that makes it more readable. It does make it a little more readable. And now everyone is uh, included. Let's see. Fire away with some questions. Would you guys consider adding a Steve Steam achievement for owning all DLC? Uh, absolutely not. <laughs> but uh, I think uh, I forgot to mention that uh, when this person said they had all the other DLCs, I want to say uh, thank you. I really oh, yeah. appreciate that. Yeah, it allows us to uh, keep uh, creating new content. It does. It would also, I think, uh, it would also maybe piss off some game completionists that a game would have uh, oh, yeah. achievements like that locked behind. 
I don't know if other uh, games do. I, I will see it see we, we will not make something like that, but it might be that in the future we will add achievements specifically tied to, let's say, expansions or campaigns. It's not completely out of the question, but it will be on its own merits. It won't be something as cheap as saying you need to have all of them. Famous last words, I, <laughs> let's see if we change our minds, but uh, at least at this point in time, we have no intention of, uh, of adding something directly like that. Gloma is asking, what's the power of the Haley Tally tail prop? I assume you mean this thing, right? Yes, uh, that's also something I've been discussing with uh, one of our other developers, Marco, uh, a bit. And uh, I think, yeah, maybe just to refer to the numbers here. But uh, also be aware, subject to change. And uh, Where is it again? I it forgot. should be under propulsion. That makes sense. Uh, it actually doesn't say. I thought it would say. Well, um, I think it's either 400 or 500, but then what is that in relation to? So it's, I guess you can use the power core and the weight and uh, the size as sort of a, a guide. So it's going to be quite powerful. But Rune, does it deal damage? <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> yes, yes it does. If you uh, smash into something with it. If it but falls the, on your But head. the blades spinning is purely visual, so you can't, uh, you can't uh, chop up your uh, your quantum spaghetti uh, by putting it in that. No. Um, is there anything we haven't shown the tail? F oh, that's uh, this one, right? Large stabilizer. Yes. We haven't really showed that one yet no, in any builds I either. I think uh, it is in the um, in the water dumping plane that Marco built. So if you want to show... Oh, yes. Possible. Okay. Oh, that's actually a really cool blue. But I should mention that uh, it is our first sta stabilizer, first block meant for uh, being versatile on a plane. You can totally use the other blocks for it, and it's not special as such, but it is um, very large, and it does have a steering surface in there. So you can use it for creating that uh, rotation around the up axis, I forgot the name of that. Why? Question. No, but <laughs> why? <laughs> you know, there's pitch roll and what, what is that? Yo. 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 Yes. Yo. Yeah. <laughs> Yo. <Yeah. laughs> Look at this bad boy. Yeah. Oh, it's such a good feature we have. Yeah, it's, it's it's my it's uh, the, it is what my favorite feature in one point eight is this camera because now you can really get to like actually show stuff uh, like in a much better way. Yeah. Than before. Find all the little glitches. Find <laughs> all the little glitches. Find all the little bucket heads sticking oh. through the oh. planes. <laughs> uh, that's a um, that's a build error. That's a skill issue. Totally. Totally. Cam is clean. I agree. Is there a rope? You already got a rope. Uh, technically. <laughs> <laughs> That cockpit is awesome. Yeah, this was also built by Marco, yeah. our new artist. Yeah, I should really take that hat off, right? It's gonna be an eyesore. Hey, you are trying <laughs> but to. Yeah, uh, but I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just teasing you. I was thinking about <laughs> whether I should do it, but I was like, no, 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 no not I'm, again. I'm just teasing you. Yeah. I also like the windows, actually. Yeah, I think are they from Airborne? I think it's the airplane windows. <laughs> You think I can make fly back to okay? Well. That's gonna be really difficult. <laughs> <laughs> I like their character sticks out every build. Do you remember the face? Yes, I did remember accidentally creating a face in oh the yeah. blueprint where I thought it was part of the build, but it turned out it was just my butt and feet sticking out, creating like the perfect turbo face. I saw that and it was so amazing. And I was thinking, because you're always using the same avatar, technically the author could have done that on purpose. Oh, that that would have been next level. That would have been next level. Yeah, and uh, if the if the author hasn't uh, made a, a official statement, they should totally just uh, say that uh, it was on purpose. Yeah. Next level move. But I think 
I think once the new update, um, once the new outfit comes out, I'm gonna be using one of those. Because there is one of those that I really like. You're gonna be using the randomize button? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm sorry, Ronald. No. <laughs> <laughs> Please, someone go use. Every time you use the randomize button, you make Ronald's day. I get a no notification in my inbox. Mm. Will there be, be new logic blocks? No. Crash test that plane on it, boss. Yeah, that seems reasonable. <laughs> you know, that I'm. It's a, a very <laughs> weak. You almost did a perfect landing on that. <laughs> yeah, that's the problem. I always crash when I'm really try harding to do stuff, and then whenever someone asks me to actually crash, I can never crash. Mm. <laughs> like, I always do the lamest crash. Okay, this, this should be a spectacle. Like, but it also not very fast. Yeah, as we fly downwards, man. I mean, that's a crash. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. But hey, the tail fin survived. Yeah. Also, Excellent. it did. Yeah. How does the. Okay. Damn, look at this cinematic masterpiece here. You're gonna need some rescue now. Ooh. Plop. All of this. Right. Let's. Uh, wha what else are we showing? Yeah, I'm also thinking. Uh, uh, do I have some? I yeah, mean, I have like some uh, we've only had these blocks for a few weeks at this point, and the uh, dedicated tester group as well. So it's uh, quite limited what we have. But uh, what is? Oh, that has the new uh, the sirens, right? Yeah, the tonight's the Right up the Valkyries. That's definitely not new. I think maybe you should show a different blueprint. Yeah, okay. <laughs> for, for reasons. Yeah, Marco <laughs> sent me those. Those were the updated <laughs> ones. You know how uh, he said you should probably use Marco's new blueprints? <laughs> well... <laughs> <laughs> he probably updated them for a reason. <laughs> well, there you go. Right. Yeah. Here's one. <laughs> this one. This one's on you. <laughs> <laughs> But I don't Not know. in front of the kids. <laughs> <laughs> this also just is the new tail pen, which I guess we just showed. Yeah, I really like that plane too. Marco has really been uh, doing some uh, crazy good blueprints there. Yeah, he, he 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 is very good at making them like very, like good shapes. Yeah. Like not making them blocky, yeah, which yeah. I feel like is often my challenge. Yeah. But again, it is. Uh, just the tail fin again, but there's also really no new blocks to show. Yeah, oh, I mean there is, but we we've been through most of them. I guess we could take a look at them. Yeah, also in detail. Like yeah. In detail, like here. Yeah. If we look at these, are free. They're called lattice blocks here, but hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but they are actually called uh, truss blocks. Yeah, so uh, clearly you can see this is uh, still uh, d <laughs> being developed. It's still uh, changing. Yes. I, I fixed this yesterday. Okay, okay. Yeah. Just didn't put it in this build, no, I guess. No, no. But uh, they look like this with a 2x8 uh, two by two by yeah. and a 2x2x2. Uh, two by two by two. Yeah. Uh, I think they look cool. You saw them as well uh, earlier in the... <laughs> <laughs> Letters <laughs> block, let's go. <laughs> Show us the logic. There's no new logic. Pink is so good, yes. Yeah, I was also about to say, is that the color you want to show this off with? But uh, I don't want you to go and change <laughs> anything. No. It's, it's fine, it's fine. Yeah, don't, it's don't, it's ideal. don't tempt me. Yeah. But I do, th I do like my own color scheme. I think it looks very nice. And uh, what else do we have here? Yeah, I'm not trying to color shame you. That's, uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's called racism, I think. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> I'm definitely not trying to do that. Oh, I know. Uh, tail propeller, we've shown that. We can show it a little bit up yep. close here. Mm, yep. uh, very nice. Very Miami Vice with these colors. Yeah. And as I said, we, we had different form factor initially, and then we uh, slimmed it down to make it more modular. Yes. No new wheels, no new aerodynamics, right? No. Uh, then there's the tail fin, which yeah. we've already seen. Large stabilizer. Looks yes. like that. 
Letters. I think I think it's gonna be called Letters Block from now on. I'm sounds really sorry about that. Sounds good to me. <laughs> I'm a, a big fan of the Beyonce control device myself. So uh, the Beyonce control device. Yeah. What the hell is that? That's that one. <laughs> Beyonce control <laughs> device. Is that a nickname for it? Yeah. To be fair, though, buoyancy is yeah. just a terrible word. I think <laughs> every possible way to spell that has been in the project at least at some time, <laughs> and I'm constantly trying to prune the project, filter it out, <laughs> clean it up. I love the Beyonce control device. <laughs> uh, then we got the these things. Yeah. Mm should maybe separate them if you're just tuning in so you don't think it's mm. one block but also very yeah. nice I feel like we see the logic tab there's nothing new here yeah it's just uh, disregard that <laughs> <laughs> yeah um, dingy blocks did you show those off just now I didn't they're right next to so I should take those yeah Yep. They're there. Yes. Again, I should maybe separate them. Yeah. So people don't think it's something new. But they look like this. Yeah. You can build a ring with the corner ones. So it's like uh, one of those things you have after um, speedboats. Yeah. Do you need rings in the game? Uh, totally. <laughs> You couldn't make rings before? Um, I mean, you could do some things, but I don't think we had this rounded shape. And also, if you look at this from, from the end, you can see that it has this uh, extra corner here. So that's also something that's oh, this slightly thing. different. I, I think you could, um, could... Yeah, you could do this one, I think. Yeah, But it has buoyancy, which is different. So uh, if you did that before, it would just sink this one you can actually get some some points here so uh, and it looks slightly different with the extra band down the side and so on so yeah. I think people want to make Beyonce donuts <laughs> <laughs> that's totally fair so just pop on your Beyonce control device here mm. and throw some donuts on it yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know <laughs> donut no. please flight stick support not this time around no sounds very cool though yeah. Yeah. And do we have any questions that are not just the word donut? <laughs> Does the propeller part work underwater? Uh, yeah. So the tail propeller we we're talking about there. Uh, I'm pretty sure the answer is no. It's a. Uh, it's basically a propeller propeller in a different shape and uh, size and uh, connection points. Power thrusts or some other things, yeah. But uh, again, it's mostly meant to be a visual change. So when you're building um, your uh, helicopters, you can put it in tail. If you want to build your swamp boat, you can use it for that and so on. Yeah. Nice. Can we have tracking missiles? Not in the foreseeable future, I think. Uh, I think there is a mod, so if you're on Steam, you might be able to try something there. But of course, we don't uh, officially support those mods, so your uh, experience may vary more than it usually does. <laughs> <laughs> which blocks are free and which are DLC again? I can quickly show you the free ones here. Maybe you should put them all in the builder and then on either side. Yeah, that's going to take a long okay. time, I feel we like. Want There's so many new blocks. Okay, okay but here are the... Uh, can I it's go in accessories? Yeah, give it time. <laughs> <laughs> it's uh, a little bit funny. It's on the lights right now. It might change, but uh, yeah, we we'll probably have to live with that for a bit. Um, here we yep. got the free stuff. The trust blocks. Yes. And uh, and the firework uh, block. Yeah. And for the paid DLC part, we just had most of that out before. We have yes. this one. And we have uh, tail stabilizer, tail stabilizer, lat or lat stabilizer, stabilizer. Both, yeah. uh, and the uh, dinghy and keels they're in old balance. I yeah, think. yes. This and this and this and this. 
Yeah. yeah, that about covers it. Oh, oh God. Yeah, that did cover it. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Yeah. Three over here. Uh, you, you're missing more on this side. Go back to the light category. All oh, right. We have. Oh yeah, the signal, signal flare. flare, and we have the emergency light here. Uh, are we missing something else? I should have had a list. So that would probably have been wise. But uh, it's in the video, so you can go and uh, go through the details there. How much money will the DLC cost? I'm not allowed to say that yet, mm. but it won't be, uh, I think, crazy expensive. All right, then keep your secrets. I would love, you know, I would love to say it. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to say everything. Yeah. Um, oh, what else? Somebody wants a Melvin plus. Yeah. That's that's uh, usually a that's a that's been a request for a while now. There was also a guy on Discord who asked if he could buy the Quantum Rudder poster. Oh, I, and I do think actually that's a, a really good looking poster. Yeah. When will the update come out? Uh, I can't say that yet, but I can say that in one week from now. It, it's not coming out one <laughs> week from now. I can tell you They're when it is. <laughs> I can tell you when it's coming out one week from now. Will the DLC be added to the Deluxe Edition? Yes, of course it will. Um, wait, so propellers can spin underwater, but they don't actually do anything underwater. Uh, that sounds like a feature request we should honor at some point and uh, <laughs> make them not spin underwater. It is confusing. I, I can totally see that. <laughs> um... I don't know if there's going to be a Melvin plush anytime soon, but we we have one, but that's very limited edition. That was made by oh, Ben O'Hara. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, did we make one? Why, no. why don't I have one? We didn't make uh, one. No. Ben O'Hara made one, no. and uh, he sent it to us here at the office. Yeah, can we you love that one. Can you please make a grappling hook? That seems like it's something you're supposed to make. Yeah. Um, bup, bup, bup. Will there finally be mouse sensitivity settings? Not as far as I know. Um, not planned, at least. Is the buoyancy thingy for the new DLC or for high seas? There's nothing new being added to high seas, but... Well, technically, the intense wave settings are getting added to high seas DLC. Yes, except that high seas is the only map you actually can Oh, yeah. Change the settings on. Yeah, to the DLC, <laughs> not to the world. That's true. Yeah. You, you are getting, if you get the high seas DLC after this update comes out, you get the intense no. wave settings. You know, these, this one. You can do disabled and calm will be free, mm -hmm. intense will be part of the high seas DLC. So it is, I guess, yes, something is being added to the high seas DLC. Um, if you already have the high seas DLC, you will of course just have the intense setting. You don't have to buy high seas again yeah. to get it. Uh, will there be a sale for the DLC at the beginning? I think you can be almost certain of that. Um, are, the, are the looks of the new blocks definitive or are they still being worked on? So, uh, yeah, I don't think this is a, a big spoiler, but we are getting close to release. No uh, conf confirmed date, but uh, that means that we don't have time to make uh, any significant changes. So we will be doing some changes, like for the emergency light. I think uh, there's a few tasks planned for that, but overall, uh, not too many things. All right. Yeah. Um, when are the ex? What are the Xbox buttons for the new camera controls? I cannot remember that right now, but I will try to follow up on it. There might uh, be some from the tester group in chat that can tell what the current controls are. Maybe they can help us out, yeah. Um, are you going to add animals to the map, like cows or goats and birds that fly? <laughs> no, I don't think uh, that has been... There's no plans to add anything like that but uh, there are some animals in airborne for example and uh, in in treasure island there are the chickens walking around and there might be new animals again in the far future and trail yeah. makers that's totally possible that's totally possible 
I want to snipe a bird from the sky. It's just always a PvP angle with this guy. <laughs> so you think this is like some uh, uh, some guy who just loves animals, but apparently it's just because he wants to PvP animals. <laughs> <laughs> Um, would there be any chance in the foreseeable future for mod support on console? Uh, it's an immensely big task, so not in the foreseeable future. We would love to do that, so uh, it might happen one day, but uh, not in the foreseeable future. All right, we do have someone replying here. Control for the cinematic camera on Xbox is left bumper or right bumper at the same time. Yeah, that's also how I remember it. Uh, where are you all from and from where is Trailmakers? We're both from Denmark and the office is also located in Denmark. Yeah. But the people working on uh, Trailmakers is a very diverse crowd. Yeah, It's a mix of uh, a lot of nationalities. And working from different locations as well. Yes, true. Yeah. Uh, more leaks, please. We've leaked a lot this time. <laughs> I don't think we've ever had a dev diary with this many leaks, intentional or otherwise. <laughs> 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 well, and there's uh, more coming next week. So uh, set your uh, alarms, your uh, calendars, your... Uh, yeah. Here's a fun one for you. Will there be a Nintendo Switch port anytime soon? <laughs> <laughs> the answer is no. No. But again, it would be great to have that. I know there's a lot of uh, Nintendo uh, fans in the company, so uh, so we understand the request. Here's actually a good question that I think is also a good ending with. with When is the build challenge? There is a build challenge today, and it's actually in just li a little over an hour. It's at mm. five... Uh, five hour time here so I, we do actually kind of need to wrap it up because right. i have a long night ahead of me so i'll just build something just in time for the. <laughs> <laughs> well you you want to build it submissions are closed buddy <laughs> you don't have time to but do it's it. a tiny build surely you can allow something <laughs> true there we go <laughs> ah nice <laughs> no, not even connected <laughs> oh no <laughs> that's true yeah. Okay, right, well, right. there you have it. <laughs> <laughs> I think this one is not being included in the stream. Okay, yeah. I think we're going to wrap it up here, but uh, we'll be back next week with cosmetics from the DLC and hopefully also a release date. Yeah, and if there's any unanswered questions, you can uh, try again next week. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's it for now. Thank you so much for joining us, Roman. Yeah, no worries. See you. Happy to be